Hi, welcome back. My name is Ashwini, and today's video's topic is default method. Okay, uh, as you know, uh, what is this method? Because uh, if you haven't watched the series of uh, eight uh, Java eight new feature, so we already completed like lambda expression, and we already completed functional interface. Okay, so you can go there and you can go to this uh, my channel and you can uh, just complete it if you are interested <laughs> or we can continue with this default method okay so we will see why we need this default method because as we know like in java 1.7 uh, we are j allowed to add only abstract method right so why we need this why they introduce this default method right so we will uh, see that okay so like now to make you understand uh, this whole scenario why we need this let's consider one example suppose uh, you have this interface right uh, interface a okay now you have implementation classes for that like class a or like class b and class c okay and class d okay so now if you consider example of 1.7 here which one 1.7 okay so if you implement this a in of three of your classes you have to give a implementation of m1 right suppose in future you have a requirement to add some functionality to your interface a like you want to add a another method name m2 then you have to add this method that method name m2 to your all these three classes if you are working on 1.7 right now consider example of 1.8 like why we need this in 1.8 if you add here a method like default method then no need to disturb this classes like your implementation classes because this add if you add the default method in this interface a it automatically available to the implementation class okay no need to uh, like you worried about your implementation if you want to add something else to your implementation um, like uh, method you can add you are free to go okay but if you like want to add like use your parent implement like parent functionality then you can go ahead and use that okay so no need to disturb our implementation class so and this is a pretty uh, cool uh, interview question also um, people ask in an interview like why we need a default method right so i hope uh, you understand this scenario if you have any question you can comment down i will answer that okay now leave this and come to the code so to make you understand uh, how it works and what is a default method i will create one interface name i and i will create one method default void m1 okay now i will give implementation to it and i will say hello m1 hello m1 i because this is an interface method okay now if you if you want to call this method then what do you have to do just come here default method d equals to default method okay and just uh, okay before calling it just implement okay if you not implement how could it uh, possible to come here right so implement i now come down and call that method cool now run the program if you see hello m1 i now suppose if you don't want to be uh, use this implementation so simply what you have to do just give the implementation i'm copying here okay uh, but you should not do that <laughs> uh, if you want to practice just type yourself okay and just increase the availability you should not decrease if you are uh, implementing right so m1 this is a my default okay so i change the implementation right if uh, previously i'm using this now i give my implementation because my child is extending right sorry my child implementing this i 
so now if you run the program uh, what do you think what is the answer okay cool okay now we understand how the default method work right so now uh, this is a scenario with a single interface suppose you have a one more interface let me create that one uh, yeah for now just can you go away yeah suppose you have one interface name j and same method j now what you will do here hmm? uh, how could you use uh, like there is a requirement like these uh, you have to implement both the methods and you want to use uh, one of the interface method so let's do that okay uh, i comma j now it will say you to give an implementation for that okay let me show you if i remove this yeah look at here it's the error is appearing here right it says like override either uh, default method from i or from j right if you click one of these uh arrow will go and it will add some syntax there i will make you uh, understand there what it is okay so if i click here i then the syntax will add like uh, interface name dot super and dot m1 because you know like super keyword is representing the parent object so let's see if i see i okay now delete this line control d and if you I, what i told you if i overwrite the method from i i dot super and dot m1 right why it's happening because it's calling the parent class method let me show you or interface method sorry not parent class interface method okay my bad now as you see here hello m1 from i right let's suppose you don't want to use this uh, implementation which coming from a uh, your interface then you can give your you can say mine implementation right cool and just run it yeah so uh, the if for the overall this topic what is the uh, question should be uh, generated like question if you attending any interview and you mention there like you have uh, some hands-on on Java 8 and the question will come if the interviewer is like asking a question from default method then why we use this like what is the need of default method so as we discuss in this scenario you can explain this okay so now for this video uh, we completed default method i gonna see you next video till then bye bye